We're right in the thick of allergy season. In my family, everyone suffers from seasonal allergies. We have to change so much of our routine when the season changes. And I'm gonna tell you in this video what has been a game changer for us, and it has nothing to do with medicine. Are you sneezing? Are your eyes itchy? I start with this cough that I can't stand. My daughter immediately gets congested. I can hear her in the morning. My son also gets congested as soon as the season changes here in Chicago. And the annoying part here is that we don't have a definite end of winter, beginning of spring, then end of spring, beginning of summer. So it can feel like winter one day and then the next day the flowers are in bloom and you have all the pollen everywhere and you just can't stand it. Your throat gets itchy, your eyes get watery and everyone is worried you have COVID. Okay, so there's one thing I swear by the entire year. Do you know this? Saline solution. Esto es agüita con sal. Does anyone else use this out there? Because it's saline solution. It's just water and salt, salt water. And I do this all the time, morning and night. Especially if you have little kids that still can't do nasal sprays, this is very safe. Obviously ask your doctor uh, just to be on the safe side because remember, I'm not a doctor at all. But this has worked for me and for my kids. And this kind of clears the passages and takes care of everything. I do it right out of the shower. I do it morning and night. Take one in your purse because if you live in a city like mine, the temperature and the season can feel like it's changing immediately on you. And then of course, our allergist gives us these kinds of nasal sprays. This one is prescribed, but it's pretty much like Nasonex Flonase. And my son, who's the asthmatic one, does this at night. My daughter does it in the morning. The only issue is that I was using Astalin before and I switched to this one. And this one doesn't dry me up as much, which is nice, because that way I don't have to deal with a nosebleed, which is the annoying part. So those are great for me. But one thing that our allergist told us to do, which really, really was a game changer for us, has nothing to do with medicine. It's not an allergy medication, it's no Claritin, no Zyrtec. Those are great too. Uh, my daughter takes Zyrtec every morning and so does my son because they have seasonal allergies. But my kid's allergist told us to shower every night. I do that anyway, it's part of my nighttime routine and you can see that video here. You're not gonna see me showering, but I shower every night, and the reason she told us everyone in the family should shower every night is because you wash away all the allergens from the environment where you've worked that day. So even if I've been in the office and then moved to another indoor location and I'm not outside all the time, she told me, shower, get that off you. Because then you hop in bed, and you're squeaky clean. You're not taking all those pollutants, all those allergens into your bed. Why hadn't I thought of that? And that has significantly improved our aller allergy situation. It really, I, it's really good. And like I told you in that video about uh, helping you sleep, showering at night with hot water has really helped me too. I add a little bit of lavender. It's all that in, you can find all that in that video too. Um, and also wash your sheets. We do it once a week here. Your pillowcases once a week as well. Wash your kids stuffed animals because all that gathers. And especially here, we, I may live in a condo, but we come in with shoes that have dirt and all sorts of things. So it's important that we, we keep a clean house. Humidifier, very important. The only thing is that as you can see the video here about air purifiers, we start complaining about our humidifier because we haven't found a great one. They're a pain. My husband has to wash them, refill them often. But honestly, any any time I start with that allergic cough or my daughter is congested, we power up the humidifier. We power them up every night. But if you don't suffer from 
respiratory issues like we do in this family seasonally you can do the humidifier just when you're starting to feel that congestion or just that tightness but seriously i wanted to hop on here and tell you showering at night i know does it so does it sound like you can't do it because you feel like the shower will wake you up that's what i thought well don't worry i shower in the morning on my way to work too so shower at night get rid of those po those allergens and pollutants and you'll sleep better if you're looking for solutions, tell me what do you do for allergies? I take all this medication already. If you have anything natural or any change in your diet that you did to help with the seasonal or with the congestion or whatever, put it in the comments, leave me a message, and don't forget to subscribe.